hey guys and welcome back to my channel i look like such a freaking mess today i washed my hair last night so it's pretty much really really puffy and i actually fell asleep with it wet so it just looks really crazy right now but um welcome back to my channel my name is romina this is the first video that you guys are watching Today is going to be a very fun day because I'm going to be getting my nails done. I typically get my nails done every three to four weeks. I get Gelex nails, so I have been getting them since the beginning of the year, I want to say. And I really have been liking them. I come to this place called Blossom Beauty Bar, which is in Whittier, California. I mean, I've been coming here since I think November. Yeah, last November. So I really like it. I love my nail tech. Her name is Brenda. Definitely check her out if you guys are not following them on Instagram or anything like that but I honestly don't know what I'm going to get done today I feel like every single time I come on here and I'm like oh yeah I'm gonna get my nails done but I don't know what I'm going to get done so I'm going to go ahead and pop some pictures of like some inspo that I have like right here I don't know exactly what it is that I want um, these are my nails that I have right now by the way if you guys wanted to know they are like this little shape and I kind of went with a cute little um, purple lines there I really like this set and it was my first time getting stiletto shape I do love I want to say like the coffin or like the square like the tapered square nails a little bit better so I think we're gonna go back to that that's what I'm thinking right now but I have a bunch of inspo from a lot of Instagram pages, I honestly, all all you see on my explore page, on like my planning, on like my planning Instagram is like nails, even though like that's like all about planning, all you will see on there is nails because I'm always like saving nail inspo um, and getting ideas for what I w would want for my next set. So I'm excited to get my nails done. Um, but like I mentioned, I don't know what I'm gonna get and since I know that this is probably going to be a little bit shorter And that's typically how my nail vlogs are. I'm going to bring you guys along with me later um, To grocery shop because we me and Paul have him grocery shopped for the week So I'm thinking we're either going to go to Costco or Target or maybe even both if we have time We will go ahead and see but I also have to get some work done. It is about to be 10 a.m. by the way right now if you guys are wondering i'm wearing the cutest little outfit i wish i could show you guys i wish i had someone to like show but i'm wearing um my cute little magenta juicy track suit i'm wearing some air force ones they're so cute i want to show you guys but my car is a mess i'll show i'll probably show it later and then i'm wearing this cute little purse like how cute my whole fit is like matching perfect so that's pretty much going to be today i really hope you guys enjoy it and now let me turn off the camera so that i look at more nail inspo and see what i want to get all right guys so i am back i just parked um i'm gonna head upstairs it's really gloomy today like really really gloomy so i'm pretty sure i don't know if you guys will be able to see it but i just got back from getting my nails done and they came out so cute i had like an inspo for it but then we were thinking oh maybe we can use that for later on in the summer because it's really really bright what i wanted to do and then i was just showing her like my shop and everything and like the phone cases and she got inspo for one of the from one of the phone cases that i actually sell in my shop the one that has like the leopard background with the cherries on top and she got inspo from that to create kind of that as a nail set so here they are they're so stinking cute we went with a brownish matte nails and then we have here the french tip with leopard and cherries on top which she used some of the cute little um stones so that is how both of the nails look. I absolutely love them so much. They are definitely, I think, the most me set I've ever gotten. And that's probably going to be my post for Instagram. I really, really enjoy, like I mentioned, going to her for my nails. She does such a great job every single time. And yeah, so I'm home. I'm going to go ahead and head upstairs, bring you guys along with me today to what it is that I do. I want to make something for lunch. I'm not okay, sure. So I mentioned in my weekend in the live vlog that I was going to show you guys basically me organizing my fridge, which 
It looks like such a mess. Paul is here to help me because there's like so much going on. There's literally no organization whatsoever. And yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and go through everything. Pretty much throw away stuff that it's already gone bad. And then I'll go ahead and put the containers. I'm pretty sure that I'll go ahead and in insert this clip with my nail vlog just because I think I do have enough footage in my weekend in the life. But if not, then you know you know where it's going. You know where it's at, okay? So let's go ahead and get started because we're gonna go grocery shopping after this and then we'll show you guys what we pick up. Alright guys, so we took everything out, cleaned it out, and it's ready to put some containers in. We're going to put everything that's still good, and I'm going to put my containers as well. Um, and then once I go to the grocery store, go ahead and fill this up. I still have to tackle all of this, but for the most part, all these things are probably going to stay. Because we looked over these, I think, last week or a couple days ago, so we'll see. And this, they're pretty new, like relish. We just got the sour cream last week. When did we get this? When did we get this? I don't know, but it's enough. This is pretty new, so we should probably keep that. These are still pretty good. We could probably get rid of this, honestly. We haven't had pizzas in a while. Okay, so today's crazy hair day. But um, like I mentioned, I, I just finish organizing all the items that, I, that we have in our fridge so now I have kind of an idea of what we're missing and I'm going to quickly make my meal plan for the week it's Tuesday today by the way I don't know if I told you guys in the morning so I have here my pocket planner my little meal planner inserts from Justinia Printables I've used these for so long I'm sure that if you guys are not new to my channel, then you guys know about these. So I'm going to go ahead and write out ideas for dinner. For the most part, I'll buy groceries for dinner and then I'll have just stuff to make for breakfast, like eggs, spinach, that's simply what we've been eating. Um, and I want to make sure to have avocados, which I'm going to write down on my list. So I'm going to write out all the things that I need to pick up, which we like to write in our little board here. So I'm going to write everything out, then talk to Paul about what he wants to eat for dinner. We already kind of have an idea. And then I'll show you guys everything that we're gonna pick up from the grocery store. All right, so I have most of my meals here and my grocery list. I have a bunch of like groceries here and some like miscellaneous like household items. I think with the time that we have, we're probably only gonna end up going to Target. So I'm pretty sure I won't be able to pick up some of these things. So we'll just go ahead and see what we end up getting at Target. Target. So we found like the summer beach area and we saw all these chairs and then this, there was a chair, but now it is in our car. This seat's like two to three How maybe? How perfect is that? How perfect would the little cooler go? Yeah, we're thinking of getting a cooler. Um, we disagree on the colors. I think red is like the basic one. I think the red one will go with the chair though. It will match. I'm more down with like the pastel or the sorbet colored ones. But the chair, you have to match. Yeah, I, I guess it does have to match. What do you but, guys think? Yeah, let us know in the comments. We're not gonna get the igloo, or the igloo, yeah. Is it igloo? <laughs> yeah, it is igloo brand, but uh, we'll probably get that next time. So they also have these like beach bags and beach towels. Um, we did end up getting the cherry, like, what is it, cherry the cooler? Che 
in uh, Oceanside when we went to visit her sister, but um, yeah, so they don't have it here. <laughs> she just wants to match this chair. I'm saying just, you know, make it fun and get whatever is random because that's summer, you know? So these are the other chairs that they have. But these, for the most part, these are $35, and I think the long one that we are getting is $40, so I think it's so much better because we're most likely going to be going together anyways. So, and then they have games here too. Mm -hmm. A couple of these fun little games. Yeah, I'm guessing this is more for like the pools. Yeah, like oh, this floaty. is so cute. Look at this floaty. They have a bunch of floaties here. And then this is just like snacks and chips and sodas. Yeah, well, these are five dollars. This one's really cute. I thought it was one. <laughs> this, this is my favorite granola. But you guys already probably knew that. Mm -hmm. So I'm going through all of the coupons from the app because there's been times when we haven't done this and where we could have actually saved money. So I kind of just went through the stuff and we did get a Nature Valley um, like granola bar. So I'm, I just went ahead and added both of them. But you can just go ahead and add it to your cart. Then use your phone number. Oh, I'm probably gonna get apples, honestly. Okay guys, so here's an overview of everything that we got from Target. Um, some of these things are kind of random because Paul ran out of things like um, razors and gel and stuff like that. So kind of random, but we did get, I think most of the groceries we're going to need for our meals this week. I do think we still need to pick up some things like I know cilantro I didn't find or tomatoes and basically just produce stuff like that. I will still have to pick up from like a regular grocery store, but this is all that we got from Target. So I guess I'll start with the kind of random stuff. I got some cotton rounds, these smaller ones, and then I really like these hair ties. They are the ones that don't leave like marks on your hair so i got a pack of these for three dollars then paul got some gel like i mentioned some razors we needed some comet so we picked some of that some dish soap and we just ran out of body wash so i thought that we could both just use this um saint ives one apparently it's new so i'll let you guys know how i like it it's just oatmeal and shea butter and i got my vanilla almond cluster granola some panko breadcrumbs because we plan on making chicken katsu later this week. I got three avocados, some bananas, some hamburger buns, which we got some of these last time to go along with our veggie burgers from Costco. And we really like them, so I went ahead and picked these up again. We are going to be making crunch wrap supremes, I believe, for lunch on Friday. So I picked some of these tostadas up. And I don't love the Mission tortillas. I actually like the Guerrero ones better, but I, they didn't have the Guerrero in the burrito size, which is what I need to make the Crunchwrap Supreme. So I just went ahead and picked these Mission ones. I hope they're good. We will go ahead and see. Then I got some K-Cups. These are my all-time favorite ones. And I'm really sad that they say limited edition. So I only picked one of them up this time because they were not on sale, but typically they are some kind of sale so i'm just gonna wait until they're on sale to pick or stock up on these but these are the honey and madagascar vanilla cake ups from starbucks we got some water for my keurig and then i wanted to try out these italian style chicken meatballs for the um, spaghetti and meatballs that we'll have later on this week i guess i'm trying out a lot of new things this time but these were also new from nature valley which have peanut butter crunchy nuts and seeds and cranberries so i wanted to pick them up because they were new and they looked very very yummy so i picked a pack of these we got some eggs some oyster sauce for our katsu sauce some kitchen gallon trash bags honey crisp apples and last but not least i got a bag I got a salad kit bag. I was looking for lettuce, like romaine lettuce, but they did not have that. So I just went ahead and just got a salad kit just to have for lunch one of these days. And what I'm going to do now is put everything that needs to go in the fridge 
in the fridge and then let you guys know how everything looks in okay, there. So let me show you guys how our fridge looks. Honestly, we just threw a couple of things here and there, but this side looks pretty much the same. We use pretty much everything that's in here or we're trying to use it up, so that is okay and then for the main section of the fridge we have all of the drinks here um so beers heart seltzers and just carbonated water there i have the last few chili peppers some water i have two tubs of my favorite yogurt so i need to definitely eat that in a little now that i have my granola i have just cheeses beef and chicken stock back there some Dulce de leche that I made for the cupcakes go out a week. I think I'm going to make more cupcakes, that's why I'm keeping that there. Then we have some bread, spinach, the salad mix. This was actually the ground beef that we were going to make today, but um, my mom did send us some aguadito, which is Peruvian soup. So we didn't end up making that. So we'll definitely be using that tomorrow. Then here I have tortillas for like quesadillas as well as this naan or pita bread. I'm not sure which one of the two it is, but we have that there. Then I have my egg, little case here, some rice pudding, my fave. Lots and lots of creamer. Do not ask me why we have so many. I honestly could not tell you. And then in here, we have some bell peppers, some limes, leftover strawberries, and in here just one zucchini and squash as i mentioned we still needed to get a couple of things that would go in these bins so that's why they look a little lonely but i do have one more of these big ones and one more of these small ones and then there's nothing in here no produce whatsoever but it is clean so that is good and then i have all of our cheeses mozzarella mexican brand cotija chihuahua and even some pepperonis in here and i didn't show you guys up here which we just have lunch meat swiss cheese and i think we even have bacon back there so i'm really really happy about how everything looks in my fridge it might still look a little bit disorganized but we actually did do quite a bit of decluttering which is really really good and i'm so happy that i went ahead and brought out my containers and just organized everything in my fridge although it may not look that organized it really is so i'm really really happy we also went ahead and stopped to buy starbucks which it's been quite a while which is why it looks like that but that is basically going to be it for this nail vlog. I really hope that you guys enjoyed coming along with me as I got my nails done. And as I cleaned my fridge, went on a whole shop with me to Target and picked up some of our groceries and household items we'll be using in the next couple of days. If you guys enjoyed this video as always, please do not forget to give it a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribed already and would like to see more of these vlogs. And hopefully I'll get to see you guys on the next video. Bye guys!